tootin' tootin' Wild Bill Hickok adventure story for you from that great new cereal with the sweetening already on it, Kellogg's Sugar Corn Pop! Today, Kellogg's Sugar Corn Pops bring you Wild Bill Hickok, transcribed in Hollywood and starring Guy Madison as Wild Bill and Andy Devine as his pal Jingles. In just 30 seconds, you'll hear the exciting story of a hornet's nest. The next time Mom goes to buy groceries, remind her to look at the Kellogg's display. Look for it yourself. You'll both find it's exciting and interesting because every single one of Kellogg's cereals is in a new, different-looking package. Of course, while you're looking, you'll want to buy a supply of cereals, too. Sugar Corn Pops, for instance. That's the cereal with the sweetening already on it. And zowie, it sure tastes great. You can eat it right out of the box like candy or out of the bowl for breakfast. Get Kellogg's Sugar Corn Pop soon. In the early days of the great Southwest, two men, tall in the saddle, cast their long shadows across the plains. They were United States Marshal Wild Bill Hickok and his trusted deputy Jingles, the most famous of those who fought for law and order in an age of violence. One great fight took them in a wide circle which began and ended in the ominous whine of a hornet's nest. Come on, Jingles, we gotta move on. Oh, but Bill, I ain't had enough to drink yet. This is the first water we've seen since yesterday noon. You know, partner, we're taking a chance stopping at all. Pegasus Jack could be watching us right now. <clears throat> well, I don't care if that bushwhacker's got a bead on the back of my neck. I'd just as soon be shot as to die thirsty. <laughs> well, come on. We've got to track him down. Yeah, but I ain't enjoying it. Jingles, what's that limb over your head? That's a hornet's nest. Oh, now, Bill, hornets will... Ow! Help! Now Ow! you've done it. Now you've done it. Jump in the creek, Jingles. The creek? Yeah! Quick, drop your guns. Come on. In the water. <coughs> Woo-wee! <coughs> Have those little stingers gone, Bill? <coughs> yeah. Boy, you sure fixed us up in fine shape. Well, come on, let's climb up. Stay right where you are, Hickok. You too, big boy. Uh, Bill is Pegasus Jack. Yeah, partner. That's right. The same man you've been trailing all the way from Gallup. Come on, Pegasus. Cut the palaver and plug it. No, Muley, there's no hurry. When they jumped in that water, they dropped their guns right here on the bank. They can't do nothing. Doggone it, Bill. This is all my fault. Never mind, partner. No, Hickok. It don't make no difference now, does it? I reckon many a man give his next ten years to get you like this. You may get me, Pegasus, but you'll find another long shadow on your trail if you do. Let them come. All right, Muley, pick up their guns. What you gonna do, Bill? This is what I'm gonna do, you big ox. Duck, Jingles! All right, Muley, let's get to the horses and ride. Yeah, hey, let's get up. <coughs> Bill! Bill, where are you? Jingles, did they hit you, partner? No, but he sure came close enough to make me mad. Well, let's get out of this water and get dry. Yeah. Bill, how do you reckon I managed to get us into messes like this? Now, don't go worrying about that. Oh, doggone it anyway. Look at us. Like a couple of half-drowned roosters. Our gun's gone. Our horse is gone. Easy, partner. <laughs> I got more hornet bumps swelling up on me than goose pimples on a dude in a gunfight. <laughs> I got a few myself here and there. Yeah, you sure have. Have your left eyes closing up fast. Hey, hey, Bill, you're bleeding. That low-down coyote did hit you. Yeah, nicked the side of my neck, Jingles. Oh, now I am mad. And I ain't going to be satisfied until we run those two bush-hiding killers to the ground and watch them swing for all they done. We'll get them, partner. You ready to travel now? Yeah, but how are we going to travel, Bill? It's 20 miles. Hold it, partner. Hold it. Things aren't always as black as they seem. Hey, you whistling for Buckshot? Sure. When you fogged up those hornets, Buckshot and Joker took off for the tall timber. Come on, Buckshot. That's our boy. <laughs> and here's old Joker. I never was so glad to see that horse in all my days. Bless his old honorary heart. Steady, Buckshot. Steady, boy. 
All right, Jingles, into that saddle. Yeah, ow, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh, cut it out, Joker, ow. What's the matter, partner? Oh, Bill, I don't sit so comfortable in this saddle. Those doggone hornets stung me all over. Well, oh. settle down and ride. We got a trail to follow and a couple of right mean killers to catch. Hi, Buckshot, hi, boy. Well, it ain't gonna be no fun for me this way. Go, Joker! Ho, oh, ho, oh, ow, oh, ow, oh, ow, oh, ow! Oh. first one in your gang to see Kellogg's all-star breakfast show of new packages. See how all of Kellogg's cereal packages have been changed. See how much better looking they are. Get hep to all the interesting games, cutouts, offers, and stories on the backs of these new packages. See them at your grocers right away. Did you see what I saw? Kellogg's on display in brand new boxes, bright and gay. The Kellogg's all-star breakfast show. Don't make a secret out of the big news that Kellogg's cereals are all dressed up in new packages. Tell Mom. She'll want to know, and she'll want to see them, too. Now, when you tell her, remind her to get a couple of packages of Sugar Pops. Kellogg's swell-tasting cereal with the sweetening already on it. Will you do that? Say, did you see what I saw? Kellogg's on display. In brand new boxes, bright and gay, these famous cereals come your way. Go see this eyeful, the Kellogg's All-Star Breakfast Show has a cheerful look. And a lift for you. Start you out with a hoop de doo Kellogg's for breakfast and a happy, happy day. While Bill Hickok and Jingles, still soaking wet, without their guns and covered with hornet stings, set out on the trail of Pecos Jack and Muley, two desperate killers wanted by the law. It was late that night when Bill suddenly called a halt. Whoa, oh, but you, oh boy. Pull up, Jingles. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, Joker. We're going to make camp here, Bill? Quiet, Jingles. What do you see, Bill? Look down there in that draw, partner. Huh? Oh, hey, that's a campfire. You reckon it's them? I know one way to find out. Come on, Buckshot. We'll leave the horses in this clump of trees and have a look. I'd sure like to get my hands on that sneaking horse thief, Pecos Jack. Easy hold, Joker. Tiptoe, will you? This'll do it. Stand there, Buckshot. Yeah. Joker, if I hear one snort out of you, I'll hide your nose bag. Hey, Bill, we got no guns. Bring that rope off your saddle. Okay, let's go. I'd sure like to lay a loop over those sidewinders. Well, if that's Pecos Jack and Muley by that campfire, we'll have to catch them quiet and quick. They got more guns than an army. Come on and take it easy. Hold it, Jingles. Bill, it's them. That's right. Quiet now. Let's take them, Bill. Not so fast. Look them over first. Spot their guns. Look overhead for any limbs that might stop your rope. Well, Muley, we got nothing to worry about now. Hey, it's a sure, Pecos. That Hickok's got nine lives. They don't kill easy. They went under the water, didn't they? You saw him. <laughs> he don't know that water deflects bullets, does he, Bill? Guess not. You ready to take him, partner? I've been ready. All right. Swing a small loop and throw it straight or we're in real trouble. Spread out. You take Muley. Mine's ready, save when. All right. Now. Jerk that rope, Jingles. Take him. Come to me, you low down varmint. I'm going to stomp you into the ground so far you'll come out and strike me. Hey, cut it out. Let go of me. That rope cut me in two. I hope it does. Take off. Where'd you come from? Baker's I told you had nine lives. Well, you ain't got me yet, Tickup. Switch him, Bill. So you want it the hard way. Kill her. Well, that does it, Bill. I got this one hogtied. All right, partner. Pick up our guns. Then let me throw a hitcher on this Jasper, and we'll take him to the sheriff at Big River. All 
Howdy, Sheriff. Brought you a couple of visitors. <laughs> Thought you might be lonesome. Hickok, where'd you catch them? In Red Rock Wash, about three miles south of here. Well, then that's in my county. They're my prisoners now. I'll take them to prison myself. That's all right with me. Well, now, your attitude ain't what I'd call real sociable for a law and order man, Sheriff. Never mind, Jingles. I should warn you, Sheriff, they're three-time killers. Almost five times. They darn near plugged me. I don't need no warning. I know how to handle killers. All right, I've had my say. Just sign this paper showing we delivered them to you, and we'll be on our way. Sure, I'll sign it. There you are. And any more outlaws you hear about in my county, just send me word. I can take care of things around here without your help. You sure can take care of the bragging for two counties, you cabbage head. Let's go, Jingles. Good luck, Sheriff. Yeah, and you're going to need a whole pot full of luck with them two. Luck nothing. All right, you two hombres. March back into that cell room. Well, ain't you going to take these ties off our hands? Yeah, they're cutting my wrists in half. I'll take them off when you're in that cell. You ain't pulling no tricks on me. Now, move. Yeah. All right, you're in. Now, turn around and I'll cut them ropes loose. But no tricks or I'll blast you. Well, that's better. <coughs> yeah. Get him, you No, oh, you don't. Bakers, he got me. Uh, you ain't getting me, sir. Where? <coughs> you got so bullheaded. Now I'm free and ready to hit the trail again. Bill, I don't understand you at all. After we chased them two varmints down through half of New Mexico and Texas, you turn them over to that Henri Sheriff at Big River without so much as a how do you do? We caught him in his county, Jingles. Well, I don't care. We caught him, and I'd sure laugh if they got away from him. No, you wouldn't, Jingles. Then they'd be loose to kill somebody else. Well, something ought to teach that doggone high-sounding sheriff a lesson. Wait a minute, Jingles. Who's that fogging down the road? Who, Buckshot? Who? Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, Joker. Hey, Bill, that looks like the sheriff. It sure does, partner. And he's lathering. Oh, 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 oh. Hickok. Hickok, I... I reckon I've been a feather-headed fool. Well, I could have told you that this morning. You didn't have to ride all the way out here to tell us. Easy, partner. What's the matter, Sheriff? Bill, weren't no sooner than you rode away from my office. I, I was putting them in a cell, like you said, and, and when I went to untie their hands, they turned on me. You mean you let them get away? Hold it, Jingle. Oh. Go on, Sheriff. Well, they, they, they spread out. I got the big clumsy one, but the long, mean Jasper got away. That's Pegasus Jack, Sheriff. Which way did he ride? The tracks head northeast to Big River. Bill, I'm eating some crow, I reckon, but will you help me track him down? No, I don't know whether we will or not. Sure we will, Sheriff. Oh. You say he headed northeast? That's right. If he stayed on that tack, he'd cut the Chisholm Trail. If I've got the right hunch, maybe we can save time with a shortcut. Come on, Sheriff. We're riding, partner. Hi, Buckshot. Hi, boy. Jeff, Joker. Bill, this time if we catch that varmint, I'm taking him to jail myself. Doggone it, Sheriff. See what you done by letting Pinkus Jack hit you over the head? I didn't let him dead burn it. I told you he tricked me. Well, if it'd have left the trail, we couldn't find it in this rain. Sometimes an outlaw leaves a different kind of a trail to follow, Jingles. Yeah, Bill, a trail of dead men. Huh. Hope we don't find no more of those. Well, Bill, this is a mighty big and empty country through here. Don't know how you hope to catch up with Pinkus Jack now. Yeah, Bill. How do you reckon to find him? Remember Shorty Millrod, partner? Shorty Millrod? Oh, yeah, that pint-sized rustler with a skin full of meanness. That's the one. Yeah, the time he gave us the slip, he joined up with a cattle drive right about here on the Chisholm Trail and... Hey, Bill, I got it. I figured you would. You're thinking maybe Pecos Jack is trying the same trick, joining up with a herd headed for the Kansas Railroads, huh? Say, Bill, that's a pretty good hunch at that. Well, I see a blanket of lightning up ahead, and that could be playing across the horns of a herd. Then that's where we'll try first. Come on, let's prod up these ponies and find the trail boss. Uh-huh. 
Hickok, you're darn near asking me the impossible. He just asked you if you'd seen an owl hoot called Pecos Jack riding with your herd. I heard him. Then cough up an answer, you longhorn puncher. Shucks, gents, I ain't even seen some of my own punchers for three days. This herd half spooked from the lightning dancing on the horns. We ain't slept since Tuesday. Ain't been out of the saddle. Then no stranger's been around. I ain't saying they ain't been here. Could have rode ten feet away and not caught my eye. Them wall-eyed critters of mine take my full watching. Got them spread out for five miles. Tell you this, Hickok. What's that, Roper? If there was a stranger ride up, I'd ask him if he could ride her a lot faster than I'd ask him if he was a killer. I gotta get these cows across the big sand before she swole beyond swimming. You wouldn't like to give me a hand, would you? No, we wouldn't. I rode her to plenty in my time, and I ain't doing it no more. Just thought of that. <laughs> Bill, the sheriff, he's fallen. Somebody shot him. Come on, partner. It feels like somebody don't like him much. Who could have done that? Maybe you got strangers around that don't know it, Roper. The sheriff's dead, Jimbo. You sure you ain't seen Pecos Jack, you Texas roadrunner? No, I ain't. <laughs> I wouldn't know him if I saw him. If you two are going to be drawing lead like that, I reckon I'd be a lot more comfortable after I'd said goodbye and seen your bats fading through the rain. Well, sorry to disappoint you, mister. But you offered us a job riding herd. Seeing what's just happened to the sheriff, I reckon we'll take that job. That, that, blasted that last one, done it. That herd's headed for no place. The island's a stampede. Right for the head end, Jingles. Maybe we can turn the leaders and mill them. Hi, Buxo, hi. Go, Joker. Right now, take a jack lamp away. Jingles, that big stiffy like you've gone local. Right for your life. some fun, get down to the grocery store and see all the new boxes of Kellogg's cereals. See which one you like best. Take one of your buddies in with you and see if the two of you agree on which one of the new Kellogg's boxes is the best looking and the most interesting. How about seeing them today? Tell mom how all Kellogg's cereal boxes have been changed. And ask her to get you a couple of packages of sugar corn pops, the cereal with the sweetening already on it. Yes, sir, sugar pops are tops. Say, did, did you see what I saw? Kellogg's on display in brand new boxes, bright and gay. These famous cereals come your way. Go see this eyeful. The Kellogg's All Star Breakfast Show has a cheerful look and a lift for you. Start you up with a hoop de doo Kellogg's for breakfast and a happy, happy. When Bill was unable to see the man who shot the sheriff, he told Roper, the trail boss, that they'd join his cattle drive. But just then, a big crack of thunder spooked the cattle and a stampede was on, with jingles right in the path of a big steer gone mad. Bill! Oh, Joker, out of his way, Jingles. Oh, you critter, get over there. Yeah! Head for the hill! Turn on them! 
Come on, Cookie, give me just another dipper full of them beans and bacon. No, sir. I still got hands to feed. What you done during six plates of beans? What you already ate? Uh, see nothing to get in the seventh one. Better give it to him, Cookie. Hmm? He helped Bill turn that point and break a stampede in the storm last night. There, you see? A, a big dipper full. Please. Mm, um, that don't call for a month's rations. So far, no stranger's shown up, huh, Cookie? No, not yet, Mr. Hickok. Just our own hands. Some still to come, though. With the sun out, they'll be riding in. Hey, here come some riders now. And I ain't seen that pinto horse before. Quick, Jingles. Run behind that wagon. Well, he won't see us, huh? Yeah. Not until we're ready for him. Well, howdy, boys. Sit down and eat. Beans are plenty all around. No, stranger, don't hang back. Set and eat. Yeah, thanks. You joined up with your herd just before dark last night. I reckon I could use a ration if you got plenty. Sure have. There you are. More where that come from. Mmm, smells real good. Say, you joined up with the herd last night, cowboy? That's right. What about it? Well, now, I wouldn't go barking at the gent that's feeding you, stranger. Instead, you better shake hands with the trail boss. That there's Roper. Ah, uh, my name's Roper. I'm glad to make your acquaintance, Roper. Same here if you helped with my herd last night. Didn't get your name, though. I didn't throw it. They just call we'll me... We'll just call you Pegasus Jack, mister. Peacock, scramble, you waddies. There's going to be gunplay. You bet they... oh! Well, there goes another good gun, and that takes the teeth out of one more outlaw. All right, Pegasus, sit down and eat your beans. Then we're going to take you where you can pay for shooting the sheriff and those other three men. Yeah, finish your beans. <laughs> and, Cookie, I reckon I could do with another plate, too. <laughs> Sort of one for the road, so to speak. And it's going to be a long road, so make it a great big one. <laughs> and now, here are the stars of Wild Bill Hickok, Guy Madison and Andy Devine. That's all for today, folks. We'll have another Wild Bill Hickok story for you on Friday. And this one's where Jingles gets all tangled up with a couple of gals in a story called Jingles the Ladies' Man. Meanwhile, Andy and I hope you'll remember to get Kellogg's Sugar Corn Pops. Right. It's a great new cereal with the sweetening already on it. You bet it is. Andy and I think Sugar Corn Pops are great. So long. See you Friday. <laughs> Yes, sir. Kellogg's, the greatest name in cereals, has brought you another exciting story of Wild Bill Hickok, starring Guy Madison and Andy Devine in person. Today's cast included Joe Duvall, Clayton Post, and Fred Shields. Our director is Paul Pierce, story by Larry Hayes, music by Dick O'Rourke. This is a David Heyer production transcribed in Hollywood. Don't forget to listen Friday, same time, same station, when Wild Bill Hickok gets into trouble because of jingles. The ladies' man. Now, this is Charlie Lyon speaking for Kellogg's Sugar Corn Pops, the cereal with the sweetening already on it. Kellogg's Rice Krispies, the world's only talking cereal. And Kellogg's Corn Flakes, America's favorite ready-to-eat cereal. Cereal.